we got to go back to 1938 with the discovery of LSD, you know, by Albert Hoffman in Switzerland and, and the Sandoz company is right there. Uh, they pick it up, they get the patent on it. But what, what he was looking for, Albert Hoffman, which uh, he takes the, 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 the trip in 1943, he was looking at ergot, which is, you know, bread molds to improve circulation, blood circulation. And he stumbles onto LSD and then takes it himself and realizes this is a very special drug. I mean, he took 200 micrograms of LSD, or 250 micrograms, actually. And that becomes, by coincidence, the standard dosage of LSD. Not because he promoted that or anything. It just it seems to be a number that people found comfortable with taking a dosage of 250 micrograms of LSD. 